So welcome to this tutorial, which is all about saving a Canva file to PDF. It's very easy to do. And if you'd like to follow along or you just want easier access, I will leave my link down below to Canva so you can log in quicker or just try them out for the first time if that's the case. So what I have here is we're going to be in the specific design. I just used a regular template. It's very easy to do. Once you are done, ideally what you want to do is click on save, excuse me, share. <laughs> it's early in the morning on the top right. And from there, if we scroll down ever so slightly, let's click on the download little link or button here. From here, this is where we're going to want to change our file type. This is probably what you were looking for or might have missed or just didn't know how to do. So we have PDF standard, which is going to be best for documents and emailing and PDF print, which is best for printing based upon what you plan on doing here. It's going to be up to you. Let's just say it's going to be a document. Maybe you're going to be emailing it. There's going to be some other things you can do. So if you want to flatten it, if you want to include nodes, you can save download settings. That's going to be up to you. But once you have picked the standard settings that you want or check those off, uncheck them, simply click on the download button and you are going to be good to go. So there's just one more thing I want to bring up many times where if you go to create a document in Canva, it's already just going to be in the PDF. So for example, this is an example document here. And if we click on share here, and once again, we went to download, there's a few less options here. You're going to notice that it's only PDF standard and you can only change the size. So it's going to be much easier, a lot less to think about. But in case you kind of went to a document and like, where's everything else? It's only going to allow you to export it or save it as a PDF. So that's going to be the very quick tutorial. This is probably what you're looking for here when it comes to anything else, saving or exporting as a PDF. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. I hope this quick tutorial helped you out and I will see you in my next video.